Today, we're going to be jumping in to take a look at the top five update ideas for Everdale. Hey guys, Alex here, otherwise known as Clash Wish Down. We are back with another Everdale video. In today's one in specific, we're going to be jumping in to take a look at the top five update ideas for Everdale. Now, these are all my personal opinion. Of course, you guys might have a different top five list, so let me know down in the comments your top five ideas. In at number five. At number five, we have night mode or seasonal mode. Now, this is an idea that I've previously made a video on. I also made a kind of little mock-up that you guys can see on the screen right here. This is an idea where it's very, very simple simple. It sticks to your clock where you might have a daytime cycle and a nighttime cycle. This is something I think would be very, very simple to implement into the game. It doesn't need to have any actual impact on the game itself, but I think a visual change, it would be very, very aesthetically pleasing. We could also add in a seasonal change. We could have spring, summer, autumn, and winter. Of course, have the different kind of colors, the themes, the feelings, the weathers going in on those as well. I think that would be absolutely epic. Idea number four. So through in number four is an idea I actually made a video on very recently and that is this little guy right here and that is auto. I would love to see auto have a little bit more of an update here in the game, be able to progress through like your ships do through in the harbor for him just to level up as you also progress. So later game auto is a little bit more powerful. The way this would work is you'd be able to jump in here to auto, complete tasks. It would give you gold, for example, but it would also give you auto points. Now these auto points, as you build them up, would help you to level up auto. So basically the more you put into him, the more you're gonna get out of him. So moving through, now into idea number three we are looking at competitive leaderboards now this once again is an idea i have made a previous video on so if you want to see more depth about this specific idea definitely go and check that video out but right now in everdale we have two leaderboards we have the main valley leaderboard which is based on how well leveled up a valley is we also have the grand monument leaderboard so if you guys didn't know the grand monument can now go up to level 300 so there is actually going to be quite a bit of competition in here but i would like to see this taken one step further i would like to see rewards for valleys who are really pushing not specifically just in the grand monument but there could be a separate one where you have to level up in a seasonal challenge and at the end of each season it resets and the top valleys are given prizes i think this would be a little bit more of an incentive for some of these top valleys to really try and push on the reputation count to get their players nice and active and i think it would be a great community event so in at number two so next up we have the profile upgrade now this is something i made a video on way way back right when i started making everdale content and it's an idea that has sadly still not really been implemented into the game. We have seen some pretty minor changes implemented into the profiles, but overall, I think it's something that really could be improved upon. Some of the ideas that I had for this profile upgrade would be very, very simple. I would love to see achievements implemented into the game. Achievements are something I think wouldn't be too difficult. As you progress through the game, they could just give you some very, very simple achievements to work towards. They could give you some deco gems, some gems, some gold, some scrolls. There's an endless list of possibilities that the achievements could actually give back to the players. The simplest of them would simply be gems. But I think just adding this simple feature of an achievement here in Everdale would be something that would overall help the community just be a little bit more active and it would give each player individual goals to work towards. We don't need to just stop there though with the profile upgrades. It would also be awesome to have a slightly better way of viewing all of our villager skills. So right now, if I want to check out what skills my villagers have, I simply have to click on one of my villagers, click the little eye icon, and that's going to take me through to view what level they have in all of their skills. But I think much like what the heroes are in Clash of Clans, I think having it viewed kind of like that on the profile would be absolutely amazing. And just find some sort of easier way to showcase all of these levels on a profile tab. Now, continuing on the theme of the profile upgrade, I would also love to have the ability to add friends in the game, to have some sort of friends list within your profile. So if you clicked on your profile, there would be somewhere where you would be able to view your friends. And on top of this, I would also love the ability to view friends, valleys, and villages out with your own valley. But right now, sadly, you can only view valleys that you yourself are in. You are unable to go and view valleys out with your own. So this is a feature I think needs to be implemented here in Everdale. And through at number one, we have the very, very simple village edit mode but one of the major changes i think that has to be implemented here in everdale is this right here and that is the village edit mode right now we have this little button here where we're able to drag things from our inventory take them out store them away 
but the actual mechanics of it just feel very clunky they don't feel very nice and honestly it's very very difficult to work with so much like clash of clans i would love to see a button where you're able to store different village builds so for example if i didn't want to have this specific build right here and i wanted to build up a kind of different themed village so this is quite naturalistic if i wanted to go down a more modern kind of with stone paths or something like that then i would be able to do that of course if there are obstacles in the way like mushrooms or berries anything like that you wouldn't be able to just straight away load up this village you would have to clear them before you can go ahead and load that village up but having the ability to have a button where you can just remove all of your decorations and then it's easier to place them especially when it comes to road tiles and grass pieces for example just to drag them out rather than placing them one by one i think would be absolutely amazing in my opinion building your village is such a huge part of the game because it goes towards efficiency you can also get a little bit creative with it and i think it's a really really major part of everyone's identity here in the game everyone likes to do different things and honestly i think it would be far better to release people's creativity if we had that village edit mode so that does conclude my top five update ideas here in everdale if you guys have different ideas let me know down in the comments i would absolutely love to hear your top five ideas while you're down there make sure you leave a like on the video subscribe as well and i'll catch you guys in my next everdale video